All right, ladies, gentlemen, citizens of the Empire, welcome back to another episode of Yes, Your Grace. It's funny, literally just before I hit record, I figured out that I was able to just, like, go into debt <laughs> and, like, just do it. So, I I, uh, I I got the moat. I went into debt for the moat. That The only thing that's with that is that it's going to probably hamper us a bit for a while at least because we're only making 17 gold in taxes per turn and we're paying everybody else so let, let's see what happens if we don't pay anybody for a week it really doesn't do much but if we do remove that it gives us 17 oh jesus oh my god it's so uh it's it, it, it's already a hard decision and I just started <laughs> but let, let's let's try to save up shall we save and continue armor numbers are looking worrying your grace I know we need to call uh, and muster as many as possible villagers as possible uh, they must uh, maybe they are just peasants but as long as they can throw rocks, they will be useful. True, hopefully we can defend the castle successfully. I've told the villagers they want... Okay, they'll be here shortly. Yeah. I wanted to offer my services. I want to borrow some more gold. I can't, I'm afraid I can't lend you any... Well then... Then fuck off! Will you fight for me? Uh, I just had a little baby I need to take care of. You helped me save the baby, Your Grace. You, oh yeah, that's right. Uh, wouldn't be much use, but I can send my husband. He is strong, and he will help. Thank you. Eleven fucking weeks, oh my god. Perfect time to gain some coin. 22 skilled mercenaries for 16 gold, what do you say? I can do that. Go, get. Merchant. I can exchange supplies for gold. 25 gold for 18 supplies. I don't... Uh, shall we shake on it? I don't need any supplies. Some of y'all, not a problem, Your Grace. Uh, Alright. I will visit you sometime soon. Alright, let's get the peasants out of the way before we talk to our wife. Afflicted with an itching sickness. My face is itchy, my legs are itchy, uh, my butt, well, you get the idea. I can't stand it. However, I've heard all manner of uh, touch of a king can cure all manner of ailments. Uh, so how about it? Use your kingly powers on me? Sure. Think it's working your race okay okay that was weird i hope you uh, i find you well your grace welcome to my caster cat castle fuck welcome to my castle pastor i come to ask a favor of you the community uh has decided that it wants to upgrade our our town okay one of the market the market is small old and barely standing Oh, okay, I don't have any gold for you. Is it uh, opportunity to do uh, properly this time? The community uh, has gathered a large sum of gold and supplies to help fund it, but it's not enough to co cover the labor. We will uh, uh, need to mine the stones. Okay, from the mountain. Okay. Uh, if we have a new, a new, uh, however the hell you say that, center of the market. Uh, Bring more people around. The community will feel us happier and safer. We need 25 gold. I... <sighs> Fuck. Fuck! Uh, and uh, I don't have the resources to be able to help you. Perhaps try building a smaller monument. Find your grace. Maybe we can get some more uh, resources out of the villagers. Just... Come back! <laughs> I just stopped paying the general for fuck's sake. 
I have something to show you regarding our child, darling. Visit me in the bedchamber when you can, of course. Oh, God. What is it? Okay. Is that is that it? Is that the only thing we have to do except for that? Yep. Uh, Eric, this is Delilah, the lo local witch. There's a way she can lift the curse. Do you exp uh, do you want to explain, Delilah? You grace, with your permission, we could perform a ritual that will lift the curse that you have been has been placed upon you. Curse. Uh, I thought it was just humbug. From what I've heard of Qu from Queen Aurelia, it does sound like you have been hexed. Your poor health, misfortune, no heir, indeed. Uh, I can't help with these things, but I think I can be of use regarding the most important matter here. A rightful heir. Tell me more. Uh, what is it this all about? The ritual is complicated. Uh, we will need you to be there, your grace. Uh, we will be asking good spirits to act in our favor. You will repeat the incarnation after me and occasionally help. What's the risk? Uh, this ritual does not exactly shout safe to me. What's the risk? Is it going to be painful? It... It can be. It will mostly... Uh, I will mostly be un... Uh, mostly un... I will be mostly under the spell, uh, not entirely here with you, although my body can show signs of pain. Oh no. Indeed. Queen Aurelia's spirit uh, won't be in, in her physical body, so she won't feel anything. Uh, will this work? Uh, there is a risk. In all, as always in these matters, the ritual will need to be performed perf perfectly in order to, to uh, work for it to work. Uh, but as long as you help us, uh, the chances for b a boy are very high, are very high, certain almost. I think that's enough. I, I don't have an option to let's think of, fine, we'll do it. Uh, for the ritual to happen, uh, I will need several ingredients. Uh, the list is long, almost, uh, but most things I can obtain myself. The more exotic elements, I will need your help with your grace. What do you require? Uh, we will need to make a brew that will help the queen leave her uh, body. A special kind of mushroom, distinctive, blue, vibrant. It grows in the damp places, I'm sure. Oh! I've seen those in the in, in the uh, dungeon. Uh, also need uh, we all will also use the herb of grace or simply rue, if you prefer. Uh, the strong smell will uh, will remind the queen whilst uh, uh, under her under the spell of where she is and what's happening. It will also drive evil spirits away. You won't be able to get it from any merchant. Uh, you won't get it from any merchant. The smell puts off customers wanting to buy uh, other wares, so you will need to find one yourself. I will mark the map where you, uh, your agents are likely to find it. Tell them to look for bluish leaves ye and with yellow flowers. You also need to, do, to buy two files of betony oil. Uh, it has the effect of easing pain, so these will be a gift for the old spirit. One mark mugwort oil, uh, also known as women's sage, a gift for, uh, for the spirit uh, of the grown woman helps with cramps. Traveling merchants often have such oils amongst their wares. The most difficult to get is will be the basilisk egg, and we need two. Basilisks? Don't be surprised, even monsters uh, want to have their heirs. To have heirs. Uh, so they lay eggs. The problem is, people usually prefer to get uh, rid of these creatures, not keep them around. Keep their young around. Many people walk through your halls, 
I'm sure uh, I'm sure there will be someone strange enough to offer uh, these to so not uh, not to worry Basilisk eggs will serve as a gift to the spirits one for the young one and one for the grown lady we need two they hope uh, they hopefully get the hint last thing I recommend that you find yourself a spell book uh, I thought you would be the one casting the spell yes but good spirits want to know want to hear some of these incantations from the father's mouth the book is called Performance of Rituals, Curses, and Healing by Jerko Z Zam Z whatever. He's a renowned scholar in the uh, fields of alternative medicine. Uh, make sure to read it if a copy falls in your hands. Very well. Uh, when will we be ready? The ma uh, magic is involved, of course, but we are still dealing with delicate matters. We need to wait for the fetus to develop. Don't worry, Eric. I will uh, be ready before Atana arrives at, at our gates. I can feel it. Uh, then it's just up to you to repel the enemy. I don't like it. I'm in debt again? You know what? Fuck it. <laughs> Fuck it! Um, let's get more supplies and... When does this payment go? We had 60. How long have we been doing that? Alright, let's... Okay. So if I do that... Nope. Save and continue. Can I borrow some gold? 50 gold for... Okay, I'll... Anything else, Your Grace? Uh, can I... No, that's it. Bye. <sighs> Map. Is that a child? Um... So where do we get the... Where do we get the stuff from? Oh, rule location, there it is. General, confirm. He'll be back next week. Oh, that's Adani in a new dress. Is that you? Uh, what is, have you done to your dress? A sailor got a grown up dress, so I wanted one. Oh, sweetheart, no. Don't worry, father, I don't want it, uh, anything, didn't do anything to my favorite blue dress. No, uh, you have ruined this one. Uh, did you cut it yourself? Where do you even get the scissors? Uh, are those feathers in your hair? I uh, found some beautiful feathers in the garden last week. I wanted to dress like Acelia, but I couldn't do it like she has it. Fabric was just getting in the way. You didn't cut it yourself, did you? No, father, I'm fine. Uh, I just wanted to ask you if I look nice. Ah, uh, you know what? Fine. You can keep it. You'd better explain this to your mother yourself. I'm just uh, telling you right now she's not going to like it. Why won't she? Because it's uh, not becoming of a princess to wear a torn dress like this. Uh, maybe she will. You don't know. You'll see. Now scuttle off. Uh, I have work to do. Thank you, father. I knew you'd like it. Your grace, the village has recently been acquired by Lord Grego. Uh, it used to be under the command of uh, Lady Masha. Uh, but uh, now the Lord, uh, the lords are taking taxes from us. Both lords. Uh, they send soldiers to collect money every week. Uh, we cannot, uh, we can't say no to them. Uh, we've been paying double taxes for weeks. They have tried taking, uh, talking to the lords, but they ignore us. Please help us, Your Grace. Um. Oh my God. I just sent my general off. Take 20 gold. Fine. 
I'll take the gold to the villagers immediately. My potatoes were stolen again. Uh, sure, eighth wire at home. How else does it? Okay, keep disappearing. My grain's too bloody village. I uh, knew something uh, moved there. Would one of your hunters, uh. Oh, God, I'm sorry. Is that a, the king of Rodovia? Your Grace, we have found the uh, Rodovian king, the monster himself. Is he dead? Uh, we gave him a bit of a beating. Oh, uh, for what he did to our brothers. Eric, I finally get the chance to talk to you. How many years has it been? I was afraid uh, you would come. Uh, uh, you would come one day. I didn't expect you to arrive as a king with an army. Of course not. Uh, what are the chances of a common thug who would go after a king? Uh, but I managed anyway. Uh, we took heavy losses, but uh, our army was dismantled. Your army was dismantled. There isn't a happy ending for you. But I sent before I send you off to the headsman, tell me. Why are you here? Rodovia is engulfed in a civil war. Uh... We have at least two madmen fighting for over resource the resources. Our soil isn't like yours. It's dark, hard. Plants won't uh, don't want to grow like they used to. I offered a solution: cross the mountains and find to find a new home. They laugh and came. Cl uh, some chose to come along. You robbed and uh, they robbed and raped. They we are not all the same. What, uh, that must have been, uh, men from, uh, uh, other camps. Did I mention we were at civil war? These men did the same in my country. Uh, these men we ran away from. Rodovia's divided and we can't all, we can't all be tarred with the same brush. Thirteen years ago, when you attacked us uh, and put your blade against my throat, you must have known I wouldn't uh, wouldn't be able to keep my promise. Uh, you must have known I would have said anything for you to let us go. I was a different man back then. I was uh, robbing travelers. Never thought I would ru uh, run into royals on the tra that trail. When the opportunity arises that, uh, arises, I guess, one that can get nifty idea, can get nifty ideas. Of course I knew you wouldn't keep your promise, but it gave me a spark of hope. Marrying a daughter of a ro from a royal family would mean Rodovia had a shot at success on this side of the world. Having royal blood would mean acceptance from others. I didn't think we'd be honored guests straight away but I hoped it would be enough to leave us to let us leave our cursed lands at least uh, when last we met you were bandits on the road how does one go from a thief to a king a king uh, that's a bit of an exaggeration to be fair it doesn't quite work like that on our side of the mountains. Some people chose to follow me is all. Uh, they said they gave, uh, I gave them hope. Not everyone sw uh, gets swaddled in royal silk as a baby. Some have to work hard for it. Uh, that's what I did. There was a, a witch with you back then. She cursed me if 
uh, I didn't keep uh, keep to the promise. Oh boy. Sorry about that. Aggie has a tendency to throw curses at people on people left and right. Don't worry too much about it. Aggie like to use uh, use this curse a lot. It never worked. Excuse me. Uh, the battle was fierce. Uh, that's quite a welcome party you gave us, sure. Uh, when we were crossing the trail, we didn't want to fight. Uh, you left us no choice. Uh, we used whatever uh, we had at hand. Surprisingly, we did quite well. You definitely had uh, surprising battle tactics I'm curious about. Uh, let me get off the ground. That's better. Fire away. The magic fog? Uh, like I said, we didn't want to cause any harm. The smoke was a common incense. We hoped using a large amount would, ma uh, would mask the passage. Na uh, naive of me to, uh, to have thought that the smoke would last long enough to, for us to get through. Uh, I hoped that by the time we cleared, uh, we'd all be gone. Then I realized the smoke was about to vanish. We had to take on a different tactic. Uh, that's when we circled your men. The monsters? Oh, you mean the uh, transit bisons? I realize ma mammals are quite rare. Uh, these mammals are quite rare, rare in your part of the world. They're big, strong, and normally we use them for transporting goods. But it's t it turns out that uh, properly motivated with a strong whip, they can attack, act as a pretty good cavalry. The fire? Uh, you mean the fire flowers, which they I was given. Uh, we used them to welcome the new year. Uh, as nice as it is they, uh, to watch... Watch, the, uh, we have also had quite a few incidents with fire uh, spreading out of control. Oh, yeah. Though, though, those drawbacks would have worked in our favor for once. The killing device. The device that uh, decided our fate. We have some creative minds on our side. The moment the battle started, our men uh, tried to come up with something that would help us get through. Uh... Though the damn thing was a trap for whoever was inside, but it was plenty of volunteers. We let them loose, and it seemed like it worked uh, worked well. Those element, uh, I suppose, the elements of surprise was did the trick. I've heard enough. Uh, you know that I had no other choice, Eric. Uh, you would do the same for the ones you loved, wouldn't you, Eric? Uh, let me go. I promise I won't cause any more trouble. I want. I don't want your daughters. Hey, Race, please remember that uh, Bayrin is Redobian. Is a Redobian. If you let him go, King Yudric uh, might not help us during the battle of a with Atana. But if you sentence him to die, King Fabian will not help us. Uh, I know it's a tough decision, Your Grace. Uh, but you should consider the benefits uh, you will get from each king. Can we put him in the dungeon? You've had your share of suffering. I won't add to it anymore. People told me none of these seven kingdoms would grant us recognition. Uh, I suppose I should have known better. At least I was partially right. Uh, you letting me go, I won't forget this. Please come and help us. For us, surviving another day is a victory. Thank you, Your Grace. By the way, it seems Redovian already managed to conquer a Diver uh, Davernian's heart. My daughter seems to be uh, like a good fit for your assailant. Your daughter? Oh, Jesus Christ. So is he going to the dungeon? Let me check the dungeon. Peasant, peasant, Pietro. Oh, 
Let's get some of these mushrooms. Darling, uh, my men found Bayrin. They, uh, I've just spoken with them. And to be honest, I don't know what to think. I think we made a mistake. I felt sorry for him. Uh, yeah, we did holistically misunderstand that situation. Bayra never wanted to go to war with us. What? How is that possible? Uh, would have won uh, they would have wanted not for that avalanche. They were just looking for a new place to call home. Their country is at war. But what about Lasorlia? He didn't want to marry her. To gain rec uh, to gain mission recognition from other kings and build a new kingdom on the better side of the mountains I let him go I didn't have the heart to execute him after finding this out you did well he mentioned something about the curse um, he said the witch that used that curse on many people apparently it never worked Eric that's great news uh, I'm not sure uh, I couldn't tell if he was lying to save his own life. What are you going to do? It's your decision, honey. We're going to go ahead with the ritual. I don't want to risk that curse befalling us. Fine, but remember, uh, you can always change your mind, alright? Of course. Uh, that's all. Uh, we want to bring a very healthy baby into the world. Of course, it seems like no other, uh, like no matter how much I rest, I'm always tired. You're pregnant. I'll just sit here. Uh, about the ritual. Uh, Blue Mountain Flower. Wait, Herb of Grace or Rue? I think. Okay, no, I found it. I sent the general after it. Bright blue mushrooms. I think I have found one. Of, is this what Vanilla meant? We had some growing in the dungeon. Alright, there we go. Uh, oh wow. The book. You, have you seen the spell book anywhere? I don't know if we have the spell book in the castle, but okay, I'll check the count chamber. The oils. Buy them from a visiting merchant. Oh no, I asked about that again already. Oh wait, no. No, no, the basilisk egg. Uh, why do we need the basilisk eggs? I know why. Uh, where can I get them? Probably from a merchant. That's all. Alright, let's go to the council chamber and check. Oh, here it is. Excellent. Read the book. Uh, is there... Thinking about getting an heir. Hmm. Sounds like the witch was talk. Uh, this was what the witch was talking about. Uh, present in midwives. All right. There's always. Uh, they always come in the form of three spirits: a little girl, a young woman, and an old hag. Uh, the residents uh, visit a newborn three days after the birth. They decide the future fate uh, fate of the child. So it's a good idea. Uh, two ready gifts and a feast upon their arrival. Three days after they, uh, I won't, I don't think we'll be able to do anything after that time. Oh, maybe this is it. Conjuring a residence prior to the child's birth is risky, is a risky venture, but, uh, if successful, they might help more than just the future fate of the child. Instead, the resonance can affect characteristics of the newborn, such as type or color of hair, eyes, and even sex. Uh, following indication incantation needs to be performed for the successful conjuration of the spirits. It is not yet time for you to come. Uh, uh, I think maybe I need to write this down, but I'll review that in the footage and, <laughs> and write it down then. Uh, we beg your forgiveness for calling upon on you. Uh, the child in her womb is yet unborn. Uh, we ask you you to give us what we desire. Let the sky t 
turn red and the water turn twist black. Let the mountain break under the manhood of our child. Let the child grow and the old uh, and the old come to us to do our bidding. I must warn you these this is a theory uh, once heard at the bottom of a jug with no text to describe such a practice. Interesting. It does, however, come from uh, a trusted source, a lifelong friend of mine. Therefore, I have decided to include it in this book. Ooh. Disclaimer. Okay. Are not responsible for any side effects nor damages caused by incorrectly performing the ritual. Understood. Mm. Huh. Okay. All right. Let, um... Okay. Alright. Leave it. An interesting read. Okay. Alright, ladies, gentlemen, citizens of the Empire, I thank you so very much for joining me today. Um, when we return with more Yes, Your Grace, we'll see what we can do about building this moat. And other than that, I thank you so very much, and I'll see you all next time. Thank you.